Welcome to the World Link Video Program. The World Link Video consists of two segments per unit. City Living features short, entertaining episodes about six friends from different countries living, studying, and working in exciting New York City. Global Viewpoint segments feature interviews with people from around the world and provide useful, real-life reinforcement of the topics, vocabulary, and language presented in the World Link textbook series. Explore new levels of language teaching and learning from a global perspective with the World Link video program. What are you doing? I'm getting ready for my blind date. A blind date? You don't know this man? No, but he's a friend of Claudia's, so it should be okay. Oh, so where did she meet him? They met at work. He's a colleague of hers. He's from Brazil, too, but he's working in the U.S. office right now. Are you excited? Excited and a little nervous. What jewelry should I wear? I don't know. Hey, what's that? That's nice. This? Oh, this is a bracelet my first boyfriend Joe gave me. Isn't it beautiful? Yeah. We were so in love. Too bad we were only 17. Too young. <laughs> What's this? That. <laughs> oh, that's a souvenir from my first trip to the U.S. I was five years old. Why are you still hanging on to it? Oh, I'm keeping it for the memories. Mm. How about this? Now that is my favorite keepsake. It's a pendant from my grandmother. She gave it to me when I was 18 years old. For your birthday? No. I was in my first year of college and things were rough. I had no friends. I hated my classes. I didn't think I could make it. And one day, my grandmother told me a story. Yeah? My grandmother's father died when she was only eight years old. Things were hard for her family after that. She went to school. She helped out at home, and she had a job. She was just a little girl. I know. She worked really hard throughout her whole childhood. So when my grandmother turned 18, her mother gave her this pendant to say thank you. That was nice. Yeah, so when life was difficult for me in college, my grandmother gave me the pendant as a reminder to be strong. That's beautiful. And it's perfect for tonight. You know, you're right. Here goes.
the most important people in my life are my mother, my father, my two sisters and my brother. My grandmother is a very important person to me. Her name is Esther and she is 80 years old. The special person in my family is my grandfather because he's always kind to me and supportive. My friends are important to me because I like to go out with them and I can talk to them about most things. I think the three most important people in my life are my friends Tony, Dan and David. Memories are very important to me. I have a shoebox where I put all the letters and pictures and all the little things that I've collected for the past years and um, have it in the shoebox. My favorite memory is my visit to my grandfather. He was a very old and wise man and he told me a lot of interesting stories. One of my happiest memories is when I was a child and I went outside Scotland for the first time. I went to an amusement park in France and um, I had a very good time there with my family. One of the happiest memories from my childhood was my first day of school. I was really excited and the thing I wanted the most was to learn how to read. <laughs> 